Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and welcome to Spire of Storm. Found this game on Google Play. We're gonna be checking it out. It seems like it's pretty much inspired by Slate of Spire, so I'm willing to, you know, look at it. Even though it has like a 3.5 score on Google Plus, and I'm guessing it has something to do with language <laughs> from what I see. Okay, no, it changed back. <laughs> Okay, I don't understand anything that just said, but all right. <laughs> That's probably one. But yeah, that's probably one reason why. <laughs> thanks for the instructions, but <laughs> I can see why it has like such a score. But yeah, it's pretty much Slate Aspire inspired. I mean, we know these options too well. So great a card. Okay. Yep, heavily Slate Aspire inspired from what I see. We're gonna go this way. Wait a minute. I've heard this song for somewhere. Wait a minute. Is this one of the songs from the Alchemist Code? Hold on a second. I'm pretty sure it is. No way it isn't. I have a lot of questions. Oh no, it's definitely for an Alchemist Code. I, I think this is the sh the Shopkeeps song. So I guess they use like some assets or something. If it isn't assets, then somebody's in trouble. But then again, Chinese laws are really different for us. Okay. I'm gonna take the nine damage. I mean, it's pretty neat for a Chinese game. You don't need to pick up any cards, you know? Screw those. Wait, is he? Okay, I thought there was something different happening. Had to make sure. Okay, why not? Let's get a card. To be honest, I've just been ignoring it, <laughs> seeing how far I can get with it. Okay, that's... Those are some weird-looking enemies. Oh, they're one of those um, enemies from Slate Spire that if you hit once, they armor. What you got? We're in the shield, not gonna pick that up. Let's see. Randomly place a card. Uh, randomly place an attack card in your hand. It's called zero, okay. Causes nine damage, place a card in the abandonment pile. Let's go to the mystery. Oh yeah, they still had that little little events. So what is this? What is this relic? 
heals six after each battle. Okay, so that's how we've been getting HP back. Let's go for the max HP. Here's an elite. Pain in my hand, apparently. So this symbol right here, that purple symbol, is basically taking down defense. So your attacks do more damage. If you played Slate Aspire, you you pretty much know what I mean. I would say I'm pretty decent at Slate Aspire at best. I, look, I don't have magic cards, but. Oh, well, well uh, yeah, sure. Upgrade those cards. <laughs> <laughs> I get more energy at the beginning of turns. Or I could do damage and gain armor at the same time. Or I could choose a maximum of five cards to consume out of my hand. Uh, vulnerability or I'm honestly going to take this because I don't have time to be getting a vulnerability and taking more damage or vulnerable. I, mean, I just went for it. <laughs> oh, this guy looks weird. For armor. I don't know what the hell you just put in my hand. Oh, you're like the really annoying slime to where I have to use like my mana just to get rid of these freaking it's these freaking stats. Well, to get rid of those cards, I have to use them. Oh no, they split up just like the ones in Slate Aspire too. Also, to get relics, you gotta fight elite bosses. I think I should be fine. <laughs> that noise you made. <laughs> I don't know why I armored. That was like passive. I mean, so far it's not too bad. It feels pretty different in a way. Gain four power this turn. I'll take that. I'll take the go too. Here you say my internet connection is not very good. But you right. <laughs> okay, so I get seven more HP. If I grab that. Alright, let's stop at the vendor. What you got for relics? Thorns at the beginning of the turn. Oh, at the start of combat. No, 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 I like this one. Since I mostly have attack cards. I 
and that attack buff does not go away. So I'm just going to continue to do more damage, which is fantastic. Nope, I'm not taking all that damage. I'll take a five. Uh, let's see. I'll take a potion. Okay, so where would you use your potion? Okay, the potions are on the right. Consumes four of my HP, does 14 damage. Draw one card, place... Place a... And card at the top of your okay. I see. I was like, wait, what? Excuse me. Yeah, I'm taking that. Since that does skill after a while. Let's find another elite. Dude, you look weak, you douche. I have no idea what that buff is, but I don't think I'm going to like it. Wait a minute. No, are you... Are you what I think you are? If I put on the shield, what's going to happen? Oh, no. He's the demon dude from um, Slate Aspire. To where if you use spell cards or skills or anything like that, he gains more attack. That's not good. Fuck it. We're just gonna go for it. I'm fragile. Ow. It hurts. Sorry, right, we can kill him. <laughs> Get my shield. Weak enemies deal less. Damn. Huh? How do you determine weak enemies? Okay, what is? That's this guy again. I gotta pretty much take the damage. Good thing I have that card though. Take a little bit less. Get out of here. What's this? Ooh, dexterity. Pretty much increases how much block I have. So normally if a card has like five block, it goes up by one. Depending on how much dex I have. Let's take that. Nah, I wanted to take that too. Fine. We're gonna heal. Let's go ahead and see their boss. What does their boss look like, huh? Oh, his boss is just gonna straight up hit me. He doesn't care. Sure what his stuff does yet. Okay, so he gains armor. Seven armor. Let's see, let's see. Block. Hit. Hit. Oh, he pretty much puts Dizzy in my deck. Just to take up like a little bit of room of the cards in my hand. you and your shields dude you have a lot of debuffing going on more than attacks now that I realize 
I'm so close. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. There we go. Okay, so we get a boss item. What does this one do? Lead enemies drop one more relic. Gain chaos at the start of each combat. Draw two cards. Place a replaces demon heart. Oh, is this what? Oh yeah, okay. So that's pretty much on my upgrade item. I'm gonna take this. Having more relics is better. All right, so there's a buff also. Whenever you get armor, cause three damage to a random enemy. I'm gonna take that. So all of my HP should be full. Yep. Played so much Slate Aspire, I already, I already know how good I am, you know? <laughs> I guess I should have got the consume buff, huh? <laughs> Too late now. The hell are you? What is you? That's a lot of damage. Uh, so pretty much just playing it. It's more, it's more like a Hearthstone RPG. Let, let's do that for people who have never played Slate Aspire or any like card road like games. I don't want him making three enemies, so I'm gonna try and attack. I'm gonna kill the guy in the front first. I know you wanna do that, but let's not. Okay, he's gonna split this turn. Uh, let's do this and this. Oh, he, they're, they're one of the robber like characters from Slate Aspire. So, yeah, everything is from pretty much Slate Aspire. The cards are just somewhat different. Well, actually, all the cards I've seen are pretty, are pretty different. Which I give them that. The characters are pretty different too. It just didn't blatantly, you know. Take that, at least. But most of the enemies have the same function as the characters from Slate Spire. Oh, no. I feel like I know what these guys are. I feel like I do. I'm just hoping I don't. Are these the little sentinel things that launch beams at me? I hope not. No, there's something else. 
Oh no, they are. They definitely are. Okay. So sometimes they attack, sometimes they give me a debuff like Dizzy, and they just spam it into my deck. Yeah, I was hoping it wasn't going to be you guys, but apparently it is. Annoyingly enough. When Slate Aspire, their pattern is more pretty much predictable. They honestly do do this back and forth. They switch between attacks, between Dizzy, between attacks, back and forth. Same way they're doing it. Ooh, combat heals. Increased, huh? <gasps> yes! I love that one. <laughs> I used to always, like, stack that up every time. Yes, I, how long are you playing? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Let's let's not get addicted here, you know. <laughs> but now I have way more damage. Aha. Gain 12 armor each time you are attacked in the next turn. I'm good. Alright. She's gonna game ar armor. Okay, so she has that much. Ah, order. Order. That was definitely not the right way I was supposed to do that. <laughs> I always enjoy playing games like this, though. Get some armor. Ha, ah, blocked all your BS. <laughs> Sucker. Okay, so I can no longer be affected by weakness. I gain HP at the end of the combat. Well, you have more HP at the end of the combat. I have a lot of wounds, so might as well. Martial arts, every time you play three magic cards in a single turn, do damage to all enemies. Up the up to five damage, huh? Okay, hold up. I want to get rid of a card. Where is it? I'm not using that too often. Wait, what? Oh, if I have max HP. Okay. Let's place the bet. Ah, he won. <laughs> okay, we'll finish up with this uh, boss. 
Not this boss, uh... At the end of this, like, run. If we have enough space on the phone to finish it. I totally forgot it was the one who kept getting attack off me. If I was to use spells. Yep. <laughs> Just sitting there like, ah, oh, wow, this hurts a lot. What's going on? Not just look over and it's just like, hey, dude, what's good? <laughs> Going to slow that one down. I wish I could steal the slime, couldn't I? I don't have armor on, so that's pretty much useless. There we go. Apparently I got some kind of achievement that uh, I will never know what it is, to be honest. Oh, what the hell is this guy? Oh, the Batman is the discard pal. Okay, so I could just create copies of that. He goes up by 10. I would have wished you wouldn't do that. I'm pretty sure as much as I want to hope, it's going to keep happening. <laughs> Okay. So far, so good. I'm not taking any of that damage, my guy. My guy. Nope. If you're trying to hit me with 12, I'm good. Oh, whoa, shit. I better hope this, okay, it does not kill. Well then, okay, you're gonna kill yourself off the first attack. Wait, what, all the other goes through? He should've killed himself off the first hit. It shouldn't hit me with the other one too. But all right, what ifs? But yeah, my phone has now said, hey dude, it's time to end your run. All right then. At least want to see what this is like. But yeah, overall, the game is actually not half bad. I might be surprised that they didn't, like, go too hard on it. But you know Chinese games, they, they go full on just copying. Because, like I said, their copyright laws are totally different from ours. So that's why most of the time they get away with it. Oh god, we're lagging. I'm trying to go as fast as I can without dying. Alright, eight. Ta! We're just gonna take one because uh, we gotta end off. <laughs> but yeah, overall, I say try it out and see how you guys like it. 
Wow, I made it to floor two without any problems, dude. Ah, uh, Slate Aspire has definitely, you know, changed your boy. <laughs> but I wonder if we can save it. Nah, it doesn't look like we can save any of our progress, so we have to go through the run. What is this? Oh, uh, that's also a chat or something you can't do. But, yeah, with that said, guys, I'm going to end it off there. Hope you guys enjoy. Try out the game yourself look up the menu and stuff like that i just went straight in thinking you know that would be pretty easy but yeah <laughs> it's it in peace out